Imagine a world beyond Earth, where human footsteps echo on the surface of Mars. A place where we don't just dream about living among the stars, we're making it a reality. Mars has always been a distant dream, a twinkling speck in the sky. But now, it's within our reach. Thanks to SpaceX and the vision of Elon Musk, we are on the cusp of becoming a multi-planetary species. Mars could be humanity's next home, but can we really build a new world on this alien planet? The journey to Mars is long, challenging, and filled with obstacles. But the rewards? They could change everything about what it means to be human. Let's start with the vessel that will take us there, SpaceX's Starship. This isn't just a rocket, it's the future of space travel. Starship is designed to carry humans and cargo to Mars, with the potential to transport up to 1,000 passengers per mission. That's right, 1,000 people in one single journey. This is not just a spacecraft, it's a spacefaring city capable of carrying everything we need to establish a new world. Starship is a fully reusable spacecraft that will allow for rapid interplanetary travel, a game-changer in space exploration. The journey to Mars takes about six months, traveling 300 million miles, 480 million kilometers. But that's just the start. SpaceX is already planning to refuel Starship in Mars's orbit using robotic tankers, an innovative process that will require precision. This spacecraft is more than a tool. It's our bridge to Mars, a symbol of human engineering, and a testament to our drive for exploration. Once we land, the real work will begin. But let's take a closer look at Mars itself. Mars is beautiful, but harsh. The dust storms that can cover the entire planet last for weeks and reach speeds of 60 miles per hour, 97 kilometers per hour. This makes navigation on the surface treacherous. Mars's atmosphere is about 100 times thinner than Earth's, and it's mostly made of carbon dioxide, not oxygen. It offers little protection from the sun's radiation. These storms and the lack of atmosphere create extreme temperature swings, with daytime temperatures reaching up to 20 degrees Celsius, 68 degrees Fahrenheit, but plummeting to minus 125 degrees Celsius, minus 195 degrees Fahrenheit at night. But the challenges don't stop there. Mars doesn't have a magnetic field like Earth, meaning it's constantly bombarded by dangerous cosmic rays. Without a protective shield, astronauts will face a major health risk from radiation. According to NASA, the radiation on Mars is 200 times stronger than on Earth. Surviving on Mars will require us to innovate like never before. The future of humanity depends on it. Once we arrive on Mars, we'll need to survive in this unforgiving environment. The first habitats won't be like anything we've seen on Earth. Early Martian bases will likely be underground or heavily shielded to protect against radiation and temperature extremes. Think of them as subterranean cities, networks of tunnels and chambers designed to keep us safe. These habitats will need to replicate Earth's conditions, pressurized environments, life support systems, and recycling systems to ensure sustainability. These underground cities will be equipped with advanced life support systems to filter air, purify water, and recycle waste. They'll be more than just shelters. They'll be self-sustaining ecosystems designed for long-term survival. Imagine living beneath the Martian surface, where we can grow our food, recycle water, and breathe clean air, all while being protected from the harsh environment above. Building these habitats won't be easy. We won't be shipping building materials from Earth. Instead, we'll use Martian regolith, the planet's soil. With advanced 3D printing technology, we can transform this dust into construction materials, layer by layer. In fact, NASA has already tested 3D printing on Mars' surface and proven it's possible to build structures using Martian soil. NASA's 3D printed habitat challenge has demonstrated that we can create durable structures using Martian dust. 
This could make building on Mars not only feasible, but efficient. By using 3D printing, we can construct everything from walls to roads. Imagine printing entire buildings in just a few days. This is no longer a dream. It's happening right now. It's a technology that will allow us to build on Mars quickly, safely, and efficiently. It will allow future colonists to build homes, laboratories, and greenhouses, all using the resources Mars provides. To survive on Mars, we'll need closed-loop life support systems. Every breath we take, every drop of water we use, will be recycled. Water will be extracted from Martian ice, which is abundant below the surface. NASA's Curiosity rover has already found signs of water frozen in Mars's polar caps, so it's there, waiting to be tapped. The air will be scrubbed and purified using advanced filtration systems. Our waste will be repurposed as fertilizer for plants, completing a sustainable cycle. These systems will be critical for our survival. And because Mars is so far from Earth, we can't afford to rely on supplies sent from home. Sustainability won't just be an option, it will be a necessity. Mars will teach us how to live without taking anything for granted. The technology we develop will not only make Mars livable, but also create solutions for sustainability here on Earth. Feeding ourselves on Mars presents another challenge. We'll rely on hydroponic farming, growing plants in nutrient-rich water without soil. Hydroponic farming is already used here on Earth to grow food in urban areas with limited space, and it's the key to growing fresh produce on Mars. The technology for farming on Mars is rapidly advancing. For example, one acre of hydroponic farm space can produce the same amount of food as 10 acres of traditional farming on Earth. With limited sunlight on Mars, we'll need artificial lighting to help our crops grow. But with the right systems in place, these vertical farms could produce all the food we need. This will provide a steady supply of fruits, vegetables, and even protein, ensuring that future Martians can thrive on their new world. Living on Mars won't just test us physically, it will test us mentally. The isolation, distance, and harsh environment will challenge the resilience of astronauts. The confined spaces, the lack of natural sunlight, and the monotony of the landscape could lead to stress, anxiety, and depression. Studies have shown that astronauts experience significant psychological stress during long-term space missions, and Mars will be no different. To help astronauts cope, We'll use virtual reality to provide mental escapes, exercise programs to keep the body healthy, and robust communication systems to stay in touch with Earth. Psychological support will be as critical as any life support system. Space agencies around the world are already conducting research into maintaining mental health during long space missions. Mental wellness will be key to thriving on Mars. Building on Mars isn't just about surviving, it's about thriving. The technologies we develop on Mars will benefit life on Earth as well. Renewable energy, sustainable living, and robotics, these innovations will change the world, here and on Mars. In fact, many of the technologies used for Mars exploration, like solar power, water purification, and closed-loop life support systems, are already being used to improve life on Earth. Just as living on Earth required ingenuity, living on Mars will require even more. But this isn't just a dream, it's a challenge, one that we can rise to meet together. We're not just building homes, we're building a new future for humanity. Mars will teach us the value of sustainability, innovation, and cooperation. The dream of living on Mars is no longer a distant fantasy, it's a journey a mission that will take all of us thinking beyond Earth's boundaries. And it's closer than we think. So what role will you play in humanity's journey to Mars? If you're inspired by the possibilities and want to learn more about the technology, science, and challenges involved in building a future on Mars, hit that subscribe button. Like this video, share it with fellow explorers, and leave a comment below with your thoughts on the future of Mars exploration. Together, we can help pave the way for a new chapter in human history.
Let's continue this journey on Earth and beyond.